Ever wondered how to mine Bitcoins? Let's start from scratch. Bitcoin, the first and most popular cryptocurrency, operates on a technology called blockchain, a public ledger containing all transaction data from anyone who uses Bitcoin. Transactions are compiled into blocks and then added to the chain. Now, this is where Bitcoin mining comes in. Mining is the process of adding transaction records to Bitcoin's public ledger. It's a way to ensure the authenticity of the transactions and keep the Bitcoin network secure. Miners, or participants in the mining process, solve complex mathematical problems, validate transactions and add them to the blockchain. In return, they're rewarded with new Bitcoins. This is how new Bitcoins are introduced into the system, but it's not as simple as it sounds. Bitcoin mining requires a combination of powerful hardware, the right software, and a deep understanding of the process. Intriguing, isn't it? Well, let's delve deeper into how you can mine Bitcoins. First things first, you need the right equipment. Let's delve into the fascinating world of mining hardware. In the early days of Bitcoin, you could mine using a standard computer. However, as the difficulty increased, so did the need for more powerful hardware. Today, there are three main types you can choose from. ASICs, GPUs, and CPUs. ASICs or application-specific integrated circuits are the gold standard for Bitcoin mining. These are custom-built for the task, making them incredibly efficient. Imagine a race car, designed and optimized for speed. That's what an ASIC is, in the world of mining. They're expensive and consume a lot of electricity, but their sheer power makes them the top choice for serious miners. On the other hand, we have GPUs or graphics processing units. These are the same chips that make your video games look so good. They're more versatile than ASICs being able to mine different types of coins. However, they're less efficient when it comes to Bitcoin. Think of a sports car, not as fast as the race car, but it can handle more types of terrain. Lastly, we have CPUs or central processing units. These are your standard computer chips. They're the most versatile of all able to mine any coin, but they're also the least powerful. It's like using a family sedan in a race. You can do it, but you won't win any speed records. If you're serious about Bitcoin mining, ASICs are the way to go. They offer the best return on investment despite their high upfront cost. GPUs offer a good middle ground, especially if you're interested in mining different types of coins. CPUs are mostly used by hobbyists or those just dipping their toes in the mining pool. So there you have it, the right equipment is crucial in this digital gold rush and choosing the right one can make the difference between striking gold or hitting rock bottom. Now that you've got the hardware, what's next? Before you start mining, you need a place to store your bitcoins. Think of a bitcoin wallet as your personal interface to the bitcoin network, similar to how your online bank account is an interface to the regular monetary system. There are several types of wallets available, each with its own advantages and trade-offs. Software wallets are applications you can download and use on your computer or smartphone. They give you full control over your wallet, but they also require you to manage your own security. Hardware wallets, on the other hand, are physical devices that secure bitcoins offline. They are immune to computer viruses and have been praised for their security. Lastly, web wallets, which are bitcoin wallets hosted on the web. They can be accessed from anywhere, on any device with an internet connection, offering convenience at the potential cost of less security. With a wallet in place, you're one step closer to mining your first Bitcoin. Mining alone can be challenging, but there's a solution. It's time we talk about joining a mining pool. Now picture this. You're in a vast field, searching for a diamond. Would you rather be searching alone, or with a team? Mining Bitcoin is similar to this analogy. A mining pool is essentially a team of miners who come together to mine a block and share its rewards. Mining pools are a great way to increase your chances of earning Bitcoin. Why? Because mining alone can be like searching for a needle in a haystack. The Bitcoin network is massive, and the chances of you on your own solving a block and earning Bitcoins are slim. But when you join a mining pool, you're part of a team, working together, sharing the computational power, and increasing the chances of solving a block. When a block is solved, the reward is shared among the pool members. It's teamwork at its finest. So, how do you join a mining pool? Well, it's quite simple. You sign up on the pool's website, create an account, and you're in. But hold on, don't rush. There are factors to consider when choosing a pool. Firstly, you need to check the pool's size. A larger pool means more miners, and that translates to more computational power. This increases the chances of solving blocks. However, remember that a larger pool also means more people to share the rewards with. 
Secondly, consider the pool's payment structure. Some pools offer a pay-per-share system, where you get paid for every share of the computational power you contribute, regardless of whether the pool solves a block or not. Others might use a proportional system, where your reward is based on the number of shares you submitted during a round. Lastly, look at the pool's reputation. Check out reviews and forums to see what other miners have to say about the pool. Trust is essential in this space. Being part of a mining pool increases your chances of earning bitcoins. So, weigh your options, make a choice, and dive in. Happy mining! It's time to get your hands dirty and start mining. Now that you've got your hardware set up, joined a mining pool, and have your bitcoin wallet at the ready, it's time to dive into the world of mining software. This is the tool that will connect your mining hardware to your chosen mining pool and the Bitcoin network. There are several types of mining software available, each with its unique strengths. Some are designed for beginners, offering a user-friendly interface and easy setup process. Others cater to the more advanced miners, providing detailed statistics and performance insights. The most popular among them are CG Miner, BFG Miner, and Easy Miner. CG Miner and BFG Miner are command line programs giving you full control over your mining process. They're compatible with a range of hardware and offer advanced features like fan speed control and remote interface capabilities. Easy Miner, on the other hand, is perfect for beginners. It has a graphical user interface that simplifies the mining process. To install your chosen mining software, you'll need to download it from the official website or a trusted source. Be careful to avoid any potential malware or scams. Once downloaded, you can install the software by following the provided instructions. Now let's run your miner. Open up your mining software and enter the necessary information. This will usually include the address of your mining pool, your username, and your password. You'll also need to enter the address of your Bitcoin wallet so that your mined Bitcoin can be sent there. Once everything is set up, it's time to start the mining process. Simply hit the Start Mining button or enter the appropriate command if you're using a command line program. Your miner will now start solving complex mathematical problems and in return, you'll earn Bitcoin. Keep a close eye on your miner's performance, you'll want to ensure it's running efficiently and isn't overheating. Remember, mining is a marathon, not a sprint. And voila, you're officially a Bitcoin miner. Like any investment, Bitcoin mining comes with its share of risks and rewards. The thrill of the chase and the potential for high returns is what attracts many to this digital gold rush. But remember, the potential for profit is not a guarantee. The world of cryptocurrency is highly volatile and the value of Bitcoin can fluctuate wildly from one day to the next. This means that the Bitcoin you mine today could be worth more or less tomorrow. To maximize your rewards, it's crucial to stay informed. Keep an eye on the market trends and adjust your mining strategy accordingly. Maybe it's more profitable to hold on to your Bitcoin until the price rises, or perhaps it's better to sell immediately. As for minimizing risks, don't put all your eggs in one basket. Diversify your investments and only invest what you can afford to lose. With careful planning and a bit of luck, you could be the next Bitcoin millionaire. So there you have it. A step-by-step -step guide on how to mine Bitcoins. We've taken an in-depth look at the world of Bitcoin mining, from understanding the hardware required, to setting up your Bitcoin wallet. We've explored the importance of joining a mining pool, and how to select the right mining software for your needs. And of course, we've delved into the art of managing mining risks and rewards, crucial for anyone embarking on this journey. It's important to remember that patience is key. Mining 22 Bitcoins in 23 months didn't happen overnight. But with diligence, commitment, and a bit of luck, you too can become part of this digital gold rush. Remember the world of Bitcoin mining is constantly evolving so stay informed, stay safe, and happy mining!